What's going on? It's TJ Times. We back for another day. It's shrimp to be your weekly motivation. You got it on the inside. We just got to get out. Listen, I'm pumped up. I'm excited. I was doing some life coaching earlier today, talking to one of my young athletes. And, you know, I was talking to his father and he was getting in trouble at school. You know, he getting suspended, you know, talking back, getting bad grades. And, you know, he was, you know, we, we, we were just walking around the, the track talking. And I asked him, I said, you know, what, what do you want to do when you when you grow up, what do you want to be? What's your dream? And he looked me in my eyes and he said, I want to be the NFL. And I paused for a second, I looked him in the eyes. And I said, no, you don't. No, you don't. And he looked at me and astonished me like, what you mean? I said, you don't. Your words say what you want to do, but your actions show what you will do. He looked at me for a second and he paused and he thought about it. I, so I said it again. I said, listen, your words say you want this, but your actions prove what you will do. And so, and so I told him, you have to fight for your spot in history. That's right. Whatever it is you want to do, whatever mark you want to leave in this world, you have to fight for it. Nobody's going to give it to you. And so you have a spot. We each have a spot in history in this world. We were born for a reason. We were born for a purpose. But if we're going to be a lawyer, if you're going to be a doctor, if you're going to be the NFL and the NBA, if you're going to be the next president, that's your spot in history. But nobody's going to give it to you. You have to actually fight for it. And the way you fight for your spot in history is, number one, you must be specific about your goals, specific about your dreams, and specific about the way that you're going to get there. What steps are you going to take to get to your dreams, to get to your goals? You can't be general. You can't generalize how you're going to get to NFL. You can't say, I'm going to go to NFL and not be specific about how you're going to go about it on a daily basis, your daily habits. So number one, you have to be specific if you're going to claim your spot in history. P, number two, P, you have to prioritize. You have to do first things first. The most important things you do first and the least important things you do second. So you got to prioritize your day. You got to prioritize your week and you got to prioritize your dream. That's right. Some people have more than one dream and that's fine, but you got to prioritize how you're going to do that. You got to make sure you do what's most important first because if you do what's least important first, you'll never get to your dreams. Number three, Take advantage of every single opportunity to seize a the moment. There's a moment in every single day. There's a moment in every single day that's going to get you closer to the opportunity that you've been dreaming about your whole life. Your whole entire life. That one moment. And if you're not careful, you'll miss that moment, that opportunity. So do not miss the opportunity when it comes. Keep your eyes open and be prepared to seize the moment to take advantage of every single opportunity. And then T, the last one, T, listen, stop wasting time. I asked him, I said, how many push-ups have you done this week? How many crunches have you done this week? How many times have you run this week? He looked at me and he shrugged his shoulders. I don't know. Are you serious? You want to play in the NFL and you can't tell me how much time you spent working towards your dream? We all have 24 hours in a day. It's what you do in 24 hours that makes a difference. That's what sets you apart. Your 24 hours, S-P-O-T. You got to be specific. You got to prioritize. Take advantage of every single opportunity and don't waste time. Make every single movement a movement towards your dreams to fight for your spot in history because your, it is your spot. And no one can take it from you, but you can give it away. If you're not careful, if you don't fight for it, you got strength to be on the inside. Let's get it out.